Let's see. Let's see. Let's see.
me. One, I didn't get my stream chat up yet. Twitch is fucking up right now. Eight. Twitch. Fucking Twitch. Stop it. I think I got the goal. <clears throat> Did you say anything else? Ah. Okay. Ah. Come on, Twitch, please load. Please. Can, you can hear me, right? Okay, I got it. Stream chat is loaded. E okay, good. I got a better mic, so. Now I need, I need to take one more picture. Wait. Oh! There's one Let's right see. there. What the heck? Uh, I haven't played it yet. I'm... Kinda cleaning up stuff right now. Oh. But I, I hope that was enough points. I don't think it was. Are you for real? Holy fucking hell! This is like literally impossible. Dude! You have to do seven fucking perfect, perfect pictures in a row without messing up once. Dude. Let's see. How do you do this one? Okay, that was an excellent. Let's see. Okay, that was an excellent. Let's see. That was an excellent. Hope we find some ingredients around here. Okay, now I need to get this Let's one. Let's see. Dude, how does that not count? Holy shit! Yeah, excellent is perfect. You have to get seven in a row. I don't understand why that one never counts. You have to do this to get the fucking Omega whatever. This is literally fucking retarded. Like... I don't understand why this one over here does not count. Like, I- Let's this see. one is what's fucking me up. So you have to wait till he stops completely jiggling, okay? Let's see. Let's see. Pose, you bitch. This is just annoying. It's not necessarily- it's not hard. It's just see. freaking obnoxious. Okay, there's two. Let's see. There's three. So I need the tiny one out here. Let's see. Come on. Come on out. There's that one. And there's these up here. Let's see. Okay. Then this one. Let's see. Come on. Okay, then I just need these over here.
Let's see. You gotta wait for them to get all lined up and shit. He's not lined up back there. The only battle... Oh yeah, there's a new battle toast coming out as well. See, this guy is like... Okay. They're not doing it yet. You gotta wait till they all do it. Yes, I got it. There we go. So this will be the fifth one I get. Use the basement spawn. Where's the safe point? Why do you have to do this to get the Ori Calcum?
door should take us right back to the lab floor. Okay, here he is. What's that over there? Wait, what? What the hell? Uh... He literally just ate me off of the fucking... What the fucking shit is this? Holy what the fuck?
He literally ate me before I could have even fucking- What the hell? What in the hell? Nice! Before I could even react, he fucked me up. I got it. Two, three, four, five. I'm done with five.
see. Come on, fellows! Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I just fucking lost. Fuck. Ugh. Or wait. Wait, yeah. I... Nope, okay. Well, they gave me the trophy, but what the fuck? <sighs> that fucking this dumb. Can't believe I lost. Thank 
So if you jump on a gold one, you get a lot more points. No, God, fucking! I hate this. What's the score for this one? It's 15,000. That's all you need. Look at how close I was. Holy shit. I'll be fine. I can get this. I only need 15,000. I just keep bouncing on him. Max out my score like this. No, 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 no. Holy, what the fuck? Dude! <laughs> this is legit terrible. I fucking hate the- This game is so bad because these minigames. The minigames make this terrible. Why- This is just so fucking terrible. This is the last one I need too. It's so boring. Fucking camera, what is the camera doing? Old one just hit it. Is this like randomized? Got it. Yeah. I don't know why I'm still going. I'm just end it right here.
Yay, I got it. Yes. Okay, so where's the safe? Now I can go make the weapon I need. Ultima weapon. Yes. Got the ultima weapon. Was there? Oh, okay. I was like, is there not a trophy for that? I got what does the ultimate weapon have on? Okay. I'm gonna go try the DLC now. Okay, let's go to the DLC.
Let's do this. Remind. May your heart be your guiding key. Picture <laughs> this. A black goat stashes away a letter, then orders a white goat to search for it. What could his intentions possibly be? Great! A riddle! Just what I need. There are many possibilities. Perhaps he forgot where it's hidden. Or he's playing a prank. Or the letter has truly gone missing. I can think of several reasons offhand. Guessing is simply useless. Here, one sec. Did this update? I'm trying to update one sec. Ooh. Ah, update, come on. Stupid thing. Re, there we go. Well, then just follow your orders, plain and simple. Yes, that's what I've always done. I followed the orders from above, without question. However, I sometimes can't help but read into my opponent's strategy. <laughs> Too long on the job? If the contents of the box are so unknown, why is it of such critical importance to the organization? Furthermore, was it Xehanort or Xemnas who gave the order? Well, it's tricky. All Xehanort cares about is the clash between the Seven Lights and Thirteen Darknesses. It's unlikely he would hold such an interest in this mysterious box. Which means, the order was issued by Xemnas, or the one who informed me of my task, you. As if, it must have been Xemnas. My inquiries suggested otherwise. Oh man, you asked him. What are your intentions? Look, I don't know what's inside the box, but it's been protected by Keyblade wielders since way back when. Aren't you curious? I heard it contains information that's vital to all Keyblade wielders. Secrets. And where did you hear this? Hmm, I don't remember. I keep my eyes and ears wide open, but I've traveled so many different places. It's hard to keep everything straight, you know? If this box is truly as important as you say, why now? I believe you discovered that others also seek it. And you need to find it before anyone else does. In order to keep your connection to the box a secret from those around you. Zigbar, who are you really? <laughs> no matter. It doesn't make a difference to me. It's all the same. I'm content to feign ignorance. The question is, who are you? Luxord. Oh, 
all the cutscenes that make no sense. It's finally <laughs> over. Hmm. Oh, really? No. We'll find Kairi. Let's head back to Master Yen Sid. We can figure it out. No. I know what to do. Sora! My whole journey began the day I lost her. And every time I find her, she slips away again. I thought we'd finally be together, but she's out there, alone. Not for one more second. That's right! Thank you, Donald. Goofy. But this time, I have to go it alone. Sora, listen. The power of waking isn't to go chase hearts around. Even if you do locate Kairi, you might never come home to us again. I will. And we'll both be back before you know it. Please! Let him go, Mickey. Riku! His heart and his mind are made up. Now believe in him. Yeah. Safe journey, Sora. Thank you. So? Yeah. It wards off darkness. It's useful. Told ya. So, how'd it go? The tour. I learned. The reason for my existence. Oh! Tell me more. All around the world, people live seemingly peaceful lives. They believe themselves to be moral and virtuous, but it's all an act. Darkness lurks in the pit of everyone's heart. Their light is a total farce. Sounds like your trip around the world opened your eyes, but you got a little bit more than you anticipated. You must have seen a lot of darkness. Those who are weak, and who desire greater power, simply strip the strong of their power and convince themselves they've earned it. That's how people become tainted by darkness. They believe what they want to believe, using hollow reasons as justification. They repeat this cycle, and their darkness grows. So you're saying the weak feel the need to justify their actions to maintain a sense of self. Can't let that slide? No. It's better they be ruled by darkness. People carry delusions of having power, but it's a lie. They are but sheep pretending to be wolves. Though I admit, I can understand why. 
Oh, I've never heard that one before. A Keyblade wielder willing to side with the darkness? Why not just let them be until the darkness consumes them? Because left alone, the world would fall to chaos. There needs to be order. You sure about that? Why not just sit back and watch it play out? Understanding hearts is difficult. More so the emotions within. I simply realize that it's easy to dismiss what you don't comprehend. All right, all right. The world needs you. I'll grant you that one. I don't know what I can do, but I will act. What comes next is too important. I suppose letting false light dictate the future might be a pretty lousy move. So, you can make a change. You have that power. What do you want for the world? Power, eh? Who knows? My training's coming to an end, and the exam's not far off. Maybe I can gain some clarity then. You're letting the exam decide? Listen to me. The results don't matter. You believe the world needs you. Sounds like you already know where you're headed. It's funny. Somehow, I can sense where I'm supposed to go. And what I'm supposed to do. Yes. Even this coat. There's something familiar about it. As if I'm meant to wear this. Hmm. No. You'll ditch it soon. What do you mean? I mean that one day you're going to outgrow it. How so? If you truly possess great power, the darkness can't control you. You won't need a silly old coat to stay safe. In fact, you'll be the one controlling the darkness instead. Me, on the other hand, I'm too much of a scaredy cat to ever take mine off. Who are you, really? Some kind of fortune teller? Well, I could lie and tell you that's what I am when I'm actually a brilliant artist, or even a scholar. This I could boring. tell you that I dream of world peace when I'm actually planning for its destruction. The truth is what you see with your eyes, not what you hear. So, your name? What did I just... Never mind. I guess there's no harm. My name is... I'm a lost master. Lost... master? May your heart be your guiding key. Seventy-five years later? <laughs> What's so funny, old man? Mind sharing with us? I stand here today because of a fated encounter. Nice. Very many years ago, when I was still a young lad, I never learned who he was, and perhaps I never will. But I see now the truth he spoke of. <sighs> we don't have time for bedtime stories. Without the kid, we're still down at 13th Vessel. And as for the other 12, 
Only three of us are here right now. Are you absolutely sure the others made their way back to their respective times? Marluxia and Larxene are both here in this time, attempting to locate the new Seven Hearts. Luxerd is also somewhere about in this age, but after our last meeting, he went in search of something per your order. Isn't that so? Huh. Oh, that. Right. Well, let's just say that what he's doing will benefit us in the long run. But it's really of no importance right this second. Go on. Playing your cards close, as usual. Hmm. Huh. All right. The hearts of Ansem, Semnus, Benitas, Riku Replica, and young Xehanort returned to where they came from and reassembled once more. Each of them is seeking a Guardian of Light. So, the ones who turn human, and then back again into nobodies are... Me, you, Luxord, Marluxia, and Larxene, that's five. The ones from the past transferred into replicas are Ansem, Xemnas, Vanitas, Riku Replica, and the old man's younger self. Then we add the old man in... The total comes up to... 11. I think we're still missing two. Now we must discuss... why we have assembled here today. My incarnations from past times, vessels into which I transferred my heart, my essence, were destroyed. Thus I was restored to what you see now. For one to completely disappear, their heart and body must be restored to their original form. That is one reason why I distributed my heart into several vessels. Ansem and Temnus originated from Terra, or rather his young form, and it too was restored. However, my heart has returned to me, while his is yet lost. I decided to fill this hollow vessel with my heart. Indeed, the very same heart that previously resided within young Terra. So that makes twelve. Then, who do we get to replace the kid? Twenty replicas were created by Vexen. The first twelve were nothing more than puppets, barely human. The prototype model was the Riku replica, and then number I was made. That leaves us with six. Ansem, Xemnas, Venitas, Riku replica, and young Xehanort's hearts. Five vessels, one left. Vexen and Demix are candidates, but backups at best. The plan for the last replica is to give it a heart that is connected to Sora's. Connected to Sora? Anyone in mind? The second prototype that was created, number I. Though erased from memory, it remained in Vexen's records. Its existence is greatly linked to Sora's memories, and thus should prove to be more than adequate for our needs. Number I. An imaginary number. How fitting. While young Xehanort is occupied with transferring hearts, I must go fulfill my duty. I will go and retrieve Vexen. Reliable as always. It sounds to me like you've got everything dependably under control. Well, I'm off to do my part.
The plan, as we agreed upon. May your heart be your guiding key. This is... Oh. Chirithi! Back so soon? <sighs> What's wrong? Well... With the power of waking, you can't just bring someone back. But Kyrie's heart hasn't been lost yet. She's still with us, right? Maybe, but this time, I'm afraid the situation is a lot worse. Hey, I've already restored six hearts. What's one more? But that's not how it's supposed to work at all. The power of waking is meant to be used to wake and restore sleeping hearts. Not to restore them after they've completely faded away from existence. You've done that six times before. And as a result, you've managed to greatly alter the course of history itself. You've broken a nature taboo. Nature... A forbidden act. Break a taboo of nature, and you'll end up paying an extraordinary price. Oh. I've heard that before. So, what's the price? You'll lose your powers. You won't be able to use the power of waking. That's all? No problem. But that's not all. You yourself will vanish from this world. And without your powers, you can't return to the world you came from. Hmm. I don't care. What? There's a lot I don't understand. But I know that this is all I can do right now. I have to do everything I can to get Kyrie back. That's the whole reason behind my journey. <sighs> I can't stop you, can I? Nope. I have to follow my heart. <sighs> well... Then this really is goodbye. So listen carefully to me. <laughs> You'll return to the past again. But you won't be able to rewrite it this time. No matter what happens, you have to accept it and move on. Oh my god, do I get to play the game? Oh my god. <clears throat> Is everybody okay? The heart you have now, it already existed during that time. Now there's more cutscenes. It went back into that past earlier. Nothing can change that fact. The place where you'll return is the tear in the fabric of time that was created when you changed your destiny, then changed it once again. In order to not stray too far from the true power of waking, 
You'll enter and pass through the hearts of the Guardians until you reach Kairi's heart. Every emotion that each of the Guardians felt, sadness, anxiety, fear, kindness, everything they saw, and everything that they felt then, you'll clear a way through it, traverse across their hearts, and dive ever deeper inside. I can't be sure what's waiting for you at the end, or what you'll actually be able to do. But by following the connection of hearts, you'll come to discover a greater truth. One that's sure to help you. But, in this flow of time in the past, You'll only have up until the moment you left for this place. So you'll have to find and restore Kyrie's heart before then. That's all the advice I can give you. Beyond that, I can only say... May your heart be your guiding key. This is Ven's heart. Ven! Ven! <sighs> what? Who are you? Darkness? Vanitas? Okay, I'm already fighting. how this game works. Thank you. 
Uh, I can't. I legit can't. How am I supposed to, like, attack him? Okay. Get back here. I'm about to just go play Jack and Ball. Oh my god! This is terrible! I cannot fight this dude. I legit cannot fight this dude. How do you... Shot lock. I thought it was just like. Not Shawlock him? I can't even attack him because when I rebound, he fucking just re attacks me. This is really annoying. Oh my god! Literally, what the fuck is happening? There we go, get damage in. Come on, beat him up. Beat him up. There we go. Get him, get him, get him. I got him. Axel! 
Oh, it's messing up again. Is this Aqua's heart? Ven's heart was so peaceful. But this, this is fear. This can't be real. Huh? Pull it together, Sora. We haven't lost them. They still have their hearts. But we have to protect them. Right! We stand together. Hmm. <laughs> Mickey! Kairi, Goofy, watch the others. No! We should all get to safety while we still can! It's too late for that. So, oh, this is the fear and despair that Aqua feels. And now, I feel it too. Fight. Yeah. Yeah. 
Then, Tara, we found you. Tara, please say you're in there. What gives, Aqua? I know that you're not him. Now let our friend go. Did I? Did I pass through the tear? Oh. Sora? Nominee? What are you doing here? Have you lost yourself, like I did? Well, it's a long story. But tell me, why haven't you returned to Kairi's heart yet? He is their 13th! Today is the day you all lose. What? Before you even face the 13, every last one of you will be torn heart from body. But fear not. The Keyblade will still be forged. Because I'm still not able to. But, I'm calling out to Terra's heart, and I brought him here. Terra? No. Terra's heart is too steeped in darkness. Instead, I've brought out Terra's most personal and powerful thoughts. This is Terra's sadness, anger, lament. Terra's thoughts? We're not going to lose to you. <laughs> Who are you? Got you, Xehanort. This is impossible! How I've waited for this moment.
wretched spirit. As long as Master Xehanort resides within you, you're a threat to Aqua and Ven. <laughs> How noble. You would give your life for theirs? You must be removed from existence. At all costs. Can you call out to Terra? No, his rage is too strong. He won't respond to me. No matter who gets hurt, it's bad for Terra. Either way, you have to leave. Go to the world of ocean and sky. And you? I got this. <laughs> Be gone! travel to different times too, you know. Did you think you were the only one with that power? You dare. Hi. You gonna come watch the movie with me? This has literally just been a fucking movie. I was expecting that a video game here. Seeing that you have also here. taken the forbidden path, you too must be ready to make the ultimate sacrifice. <laughs> Oh, another fight. Yeah. It's not. Ka Kakarot is easy. Here we go. I'm gonna play it after this. So. Stop it. Over here. There. It's over. Over here. Enjoy. Ow. Over here. Over here. Come on. Finish him up. Finish him up. Over here. Over here. There we go. You resolve. The 
this awaits you! So wait, I can go to the workshop? Can you upgrade the Ultima weapon? Nope. I don't know if I want to keep playing. This is just literally the end of the game. I think I'm gonna stop here for now. What? Yeah, I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna play Dragon Ball. I'll be back. <laughs>